I love this. It makes it reminds me of when I was a Good little witch. girl. You can I love grant it. My Good wish. Witch. No, I love this because every little girl loves to play princess. And we're back yes. with Tanya Mimi, who's making lace princess crowns that are perfect for our little little ones. Yes, and they big are. girls too. I love it. Big girls too. They're great for birthday parties. Uh, it's a, it's an awesome summer project. Super inexpensive, and it creates this this entire fantasy world for little girls, which we know that we all love. And I know that you tried this earlier with Ava, our little I star. Did. So let's take a look at Check how we out. made this with Ava. <laughs> we had a blast. Ava, what are you making? A crown for you. Oh, you're making one for mommy? Mm -hmm. So we can dress up together like princess? Yep. Yeah. What else are you going to put on it? Glitter. You could put the white glitter on too, hun. Okay, that's a lot of glitter. Okay. Is your crown done? Yep. Okay, so we're going to let it dry, okay? <laughs> I can't believe it. So we're not fitting me. <laughs> oh, yeah. What does look like? I'm a princess. Are you a princess? That is a crown. What is our little girl's crown? I know. It reminds me of when I was little too. But what do we need to make these little things? Okay, super easy. So right here, some metallic spray paint, some metallic paint, acrylic paint, some Mod Podge or fabric stif stiffener, wax paper, some scissors glitter, any kind of um, lace that reminds you of a crown, and uh, that's about it. And then just your embellishments. Okay, all right, this is, a, so how do we put this together? Show us step by step. Okay, so it's super easy. So the first okay. thing we're gonna do, we are going to take whichever piece of lace you want. So um, you have, and see these are different kinds. Some are some are cotton, some are synthetic. Well, this looks like a real crown, and you it said to find, so this reminds me of a real, can we use this one? You wanna one? do that one? All right. Sure. So this is, is a, a synthetic okay. crown, it means it, or oh. lace, mm -hmm. which is, it actually saturates really well. So you should use synthetic instead of... Well, I prefer it. I mean, some of these right here, like this is cotton. This mm -hmm. one over here yes. is cotton. Yes. Like your and, um, but the thing is, it's hard. It takes a little while to get the glue off of it. Oh. With the synthetic one, you just dump it in the glue like this and run your fingers down it. Oh, that's easy. Okay. And then it's pretty much done. And then what we're going to do, hold on a moment. If you could just move one of those sure. out of the way. Move these out of the way. We're just going to lay it on the wax paper. Okay, now this is the next step. So it's a little, well, here, I'll leave these on it. How long and does that need to And then you just kind of want to brush out so that, you know, the little windows in the lace, so that oh. the windows in the lace are, are popped. Because what happens is the glue actually creates little windows. So if I pick this up. Oh, sure. Yeah. See how some of them aren't completely? So you just want to kind of touch them, pop them all, and make sure that you can really see the detail of the lace, right. okay? Then when you're done that, you just let it lay out on your wax paper overnight, okay? Then what happens is it becomes nice and stiff. It is stiff. Like this one here. Can I ask you something? Can you before? Can you put like little jewels on here? Of course, which is, is that what this is for? My crowns. Oh, yeah. I see. Okay. So the next step, what you want to oh, do? Love it. Is Go you ahead. can, which I did here, is you paint the stiffened piece of lace, okay? So this one, I spray painted this one silver, and then we spray painted this one gold. Mm -hmm. So Christina, you can take, you can do the next step, which, which is, is to actually form the circular the okay. shape of the crown. Just put a dab of some hot glue. Okay. And if you want too, you can kind of fan it out. Okay, so if you want to fan it out a little on the top to give more of that, that little crown effect, mm -hmm. or you can do it straight too, like a straight circle. See how easy that is? Yeah. And you just try and match up the pattern. You have to wait till this dries a little bit though, right? Yeah, this just a can. little bit, but we can finish off Ava's if you'd like. Sure, this okay. This is the one that Ava made. I okay. Love that. So the crown is now formed, and then if you'd like, you can embellish it too. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, wouldn't she like to finish her own, or is she going to get mad at me? No, we, we made okay. so many this morning. Oh, I'm okay. Just grab this one here. All right. And so you can. <laughs> okay. Because okay, I made, don't want Ava to get. We made tons this morning. Oh. Yeah. There, um, see how okay. pretty it looks? So it's coming together. And then, if you want to take it one step further, which I found was really easy for Ava to put on her head and keep it on her head, is you get these little, these little uh, hair bands. And I got this in a in a in a CVS store actually. Uh -huh. And they're just a few dollars each. And you put a little dab of glue on each side of the crown, one here, and one here. And then when it dries, 
It'll look it comes fun. out like these. So there's one here and one here. I and love so it. This was super oh, easy see, for Ava to keep on her head and play around and dance around. These are her wings here, so you can add little accessories to it. And I, you know, you can make a little wand if you want. And I have to tell you, we had a blast. We, I had so much fun with her. And I'm it just make creates bracelets. Look at that. Yeah, you can do that too. That's fun. And then you can embellish it with all kinds with of stuff. With all kinds of different fun. things, yeah. All right. Thank thank you. Look at this one. This is so cute. There you go. Why is mine crooked? All right. For more information, visit Pinterest.com, Home and Family, <laughs> Family TV. And thank you, Tanya. Next, next is the bathing suit competition. We'll be right back with that. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you do on the interview portion? <laughs> Not so good.